Hello world, what is up everyone? Welcome back to tonight's video where I'm gonna share with you guys my in-depth nighttime skincare routine. Now I have got a lot to share with you guys. This is the skincare routine that I do every time that I just wanna take a little bit of time to pamper myself, just to treat myself right, which let's be honest, I feel like that's every single night. So I've got a lot of skincare products in here, some new ones, some old ones. I've also got some crystals. We are ready to soothe ourselves and relax. And you guys, this is all about positivity. So my in-depth skincare routine is very, you know, thorough. We are going to cleanse the skin. We're going to get rid of any dirt, oil, impurities. I've actually been suffering from a couple of breakouts. Oh my gosh, I feel like it's because I told you guys that I don't get breakouts that often or because I'm filming so many videos and trying so many skincare products that my skin is like, Trevor, we just need a little bit of a break. So I do need to spot treat those pimples. We need to cleanse my skin. I'm gonna do some skincare treatments. I'm gonna walk you guys through the entire process. So let's dive right into it. Now, starting off with my brand new platinum hair, you guys, I do need to put some purple conditioner in here and I do this at this point almost every single day. So because everything has been closed recently and not all the stores have been opened, I just went to the drugstore and I picked up this L'Oreal Ever Pure. This is their sulfate free hibiscus and purple dye. To be honest, I'm about halfway through the bottle. I've only had it, I don't know, maybe like a week and a half but it's not my favorite. Normally I like to get a really dark purple hair mask. This one, as you guys are gonna see, it does look purple here. This is gonna help to eliminate any brassiness or redness, but when you apply it to the hair, it almost turns like a blue color. I don't know if you guys can see that. It looks pretty purple on camera, but in real life, it's almost like I don't know, a really light shade of blue. However, it does help to keep that brassiness down, so we're not gonna complain, we're gonna use what we have and really get this hair nice and treated. So the first step in my nighttime skincare routine, if you're someone who wears makeup, powders, foundations, or anything that you really need to break down off the skin, before you go in with your water-soluble, you know, typical foaming cleanser, you do wanna make sure that you're doing a double cleanse with an oil-based cleanser. And because I have SPF on my skin right now, I am gonna start with the oil cleanser. Now, this is the fake cleansing balm by I'm From. It contains almost 10% fig extract and fig is fantastic in the skin for brightening. So I'm just going to take not that much here, just a little bit. We don't need to be wasteful and it melts instantly as soon as it starts to warm up in your fingers and you just want to massage this all over the skin. So if you're wearing very heavy makeup, you can really go in with this oil cleanser and it's just gonna melt right off your skin. So because I don't have anything too heavy on my skin today, there's not that much to break down. There we go, perfect. So let's just take off this oil cleanser, we'll wipe this off. Now the thing is, if you're using a cleansing balm or an oil cleanser, or if you're even just using a makeup wipe or a micellar water, those things are not final cleansers. You do have to make sure that you're using another cleanser to get rid of the oil cleanser. So for my foaming cleanser today, or my water-based cleanser, I'm gonna be using the Foreo Micro Foam Cleanser. This is a fantastic cleanser to pair with your Luna Foreo Mini. You guys, you know I have been obsessed. I feel like I just keep talking about it. So I'm just gonna get my skin nice and wet here and we're gonna go in and wash off that oil cleanser. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of the foaming cleanser and I'm actually going to apply it directly to the device here. I'm just gonna make a little bit of bubbles here, swirl this on the skin. Now you can control this through an app on your phone or you can actually just push the button on the back which is what I'm gonna be doing tonight. I don't really take my phone into the bathroom with me at night when I'm doing my skincare. I really just like to take my time and it's just like some time for me. You know, shut the world off. I'm so connected to my phone throughout the day. I'm always answering your guys' comments. That's my favorite thing, but I feel like it's endless. I love to connect and I feel like I'm always sharing. So my nighttime skincare routine is really just a time to kind of take a breath. Okay, I'm gonna rinse this off. I'll meet you guys right back here. Ooh, my goodness, my skin, you guys. It is feeling just the way I like it. So next up, I am gonna do a little bit of exfoliation and you guys are gonna be shocked out there because I'm not using my, you know, my holy grail, my Bosha exfoliating peel gel. I've actually run out of that. So today we're going in for another Old Faithful. Normally I don't use face scrubs. I find them very harsh. I'm very susceptible to broken veins along my nose. I've spent a lot of money trying to correct that damage from over exfoliating when I was younger. But if I must, because times are tough out there, you guys, my second favorite exfoliator has been in my arsenal for years. The Dr. Brandt Microdermabrasion Age-Defying Exfoliator. I just find that this is such a refined texture 
texture. It's so smooth. I'm just gonna take a small little amount here. In my experience, this has never flared my skin up, never broken it out. I'm just applying a little bit of water just so that it has a little bit of slip so it's not quite so powerful. And I'm just gonna start by doing gentle circle motions and just work this all over my face. If you've used this before, you know exactly what I'm talking about. It is such a refined texture. It feels like super finely milled sand. I know that that sounds scary to some, especially when it comes to skincare, but it does. All right, I feel like that is enough. Let's rinse this off the skin and move right along. Now that my skin is completely cleansed and that top layer of kind of dead, dull skin has been removed, I am gonna go ahead and apply a little bit of one of my favorite clay masks. This is the Generation Clay Brightening Purple Clay Mask. I just like to use a small little bit. I'm just gonna put some on my fingertips here take a little bit to the places where my skin is most oily. So for me, that's right under my eyes here. I'm just gonna pack it in and just really get it in deep into those pores. This is really gonna help to pull out any excess oil from the pore. And after we wash the face mask off, the pore is actually gonna be able to look a little bit more constricted, a little bit tighter. So I'm gonna set a timer. I'm not gonna make you guys wait for the next 10 minutes. I'm gonna set a timer for 10 minutes. I'll come back here, show you guys. Then we're gonna rinse it off and move right along to all of my juicy skin treatments. The best part of today's video Video. All right, I'm gonna set my timer. I'll see you guys in 10 minutes. All right, so this mask has dried down. It has sucked out all that dirt, all that oil. I'm gonna rinse this off. I'm gonna rinse my hair mask out of my hair at the same time. Actually, I feel like at this point, I might just get in the shower. So maybe I'll get in the shower. I'll rinse this off at the snap of my fingers. I'll be right back. I cannot, you guys, I just had the most relaxing shower. I put on some classical music. I actually turned the lights off for a minute and I just kind of stood there and just took my time. So as you guys can see, the purple conditioner definitely does the magic, it takes the edge off anyway. And my skin is, oh, oh, I just shook myself. My fingers just slipped right off my skin. Super smooth, it looks amazing. I mean, I'm just looking in the mirror over here. You're winning, Trevor. So up next, I'm going to apply my Mugwort Essence Toner from I'm From. Because we just went ham on the cleansing, I am going to use the Mugwort Essence Super Hydrating and Comforting on the Skin. It's also an antibacterial. And because we did exfoliate and kind of remove that top protective layer of the skin, using an antibacterial or something that can help control acne breakouts is great. So I'm just gonna press this into the skin. It is so soothing and calming. Now I actually did an entire review on the Mugwort Essence. So if you're curious, I'll have that linked down below. So up next, my favorite time of night, you guys, and that is layering on my serums. Now I'm gonna go in with the Claire's Rich Moist Soothing Serum, one of my favorite all time hydrating serums. So really drench it in that hydration. This has niacinamide in it. It's also cooling, calming and soothing. So as you guys can see, I'm gonna use we're going with two pumps, you guys, and we are gonna layer on another serum on top of this, but I'm just gonna rub it right between my fingers and then just press it right into the skin. Now, this serum is very sticky. It does have a sticky texture, but don't worry, it dries down totally smooth. I'm gonna put this on my neck too. It is loaded, full of hyaluronic acid, which is gonna pull all of that moisture and water, which since we just got out of the shower, the hyaluronic acid is just gonna soak that up, really plump up the skin. And then when we apply our moisturizer on top, it's gonna seal it all in. So now that we've layered that on, I am gonna go in with my most recent favorite, the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Synchronize Recovery Complex 2 Serum. Now, of course, this is from Estee Lauder's Advanced Night Repair line, and you guys, this is a fabulous serum. The only downside is it's pretty pricey, but this is a probiotic. It has bifida ferment lysate in there. It has lactobacillus. There's so many probiotics. There's so many ferments and beautiful skincare ingredients in this serum that although it is very expensive, I've really been loving it lately. It has no scent. So if you're scent sensitive, you don't have to worry about that. And I just love to really press it into my problem areas. And of course the advanced night repair is meant to be used at night. So while you're sleeping, it actually helps to repair your skin. I've actually dug into the patent for the Estee Lauder Advanced Net Repair Formula. I don't know, I would say it's about 50 pages long. It is very intense. I'm working my way through it. I really wanna understand everything and I'll continue to report back on everything I learned. Now, recently I've also been loving the Advanced Net Repair Eye Supercharge Complex. Now I'm just gonna put a little bit here. As you guys can see, it is a gel texture. It's thick, but not too thick. And we're just gonna apply it right to my under eye area. Now immediately, the texture of this is insane. I mean, look at this, you guys. 
So now that my skin is totally cleansed, exfoliated, masked, we've applied our treatments, our eye cream, we're finally on our last step, which is an overnight face mask. Now, I feel like I need to get this on my skin, otherwise we're never gonna get to bed at this rate. I could just apply skincare all night long until the wee hours of the morning. Now, if you're an OG watcher of my channel, y'all, you know I love when it comes to overnight masks or overnight creams, there's two. There's the Clinique Turnaround Overnight Cream, contains salicylic acid, makes your skin buttery smooth the next morning. If not that one, the Origins Drink Up Intensive Overnight Hydrating Mask with Avocado and Swiss Glacial Water. My absolute number one overnight mask. I have tried so many of them and I go back to this one over and over and over again. Now it does contain avocado oil, which has so many beautiful hydration properties. It drenches your skin in hydration. Now, in my opinion, aside with the avocado oil, the other star of this overnight mask is the urea that they use. Urea is of course a super humectant. It brings moisture into the skin, but it also helps the skin naturally, encourages it to turn over. So between the avocado oil and the urea in this formula, when you wake up the next morning, aside from the Clinique Turnaround Cream, overnight cream, this is the only other, literally the only other overnight mask or nighttime cream I've ever used that gives crazy results. I like to take a big generous amount because I like to totally coat my skin in it. Now I should mention, and this is really weird because when I was going through the ingredients again, I was like, honestly a little bit confused. There is a lot of citrus style oils in here, like orange peel and other citrus essential oils, which I find very weird because normally you don't see essential oils in many skincare products anymore. I feel like that's kind of a dated formula. I feel like essential oils in general, especially when applying them to the skin, they can be super irritating. And citrus in particular is very irritating for the skin. So I don't know why that's in there, to be honest. I don't know if it's a scent thing or what, but really we could do without the scent if they wanted to take that out. For me personally, it's never caused any problems, any breakouts, any acne. I've only seen like, seriously, you guys, honestly, this is very honest, amazing results when you wake up the next morning. Oh yes, you guys. All right, all of those serums, all of those actives are sealed into the skin and we are ready to go to sleep. I'm ready to call it a night, you guys. We have conditioned my hair. We did our purple conditioner. We cleansed the skin so thoroughly. We got rid of all of that dirt, all the pollution for the day. We put on some beautiful ingredients and then we sealed it all in. All right, guys, so that is my nighttime skincare routine and a few of my everyday skincare products that really help add in hydration, smooth out my skin, get rid of all of that dirt, that oil. Your nighttime skincare routine is so important because as you sleep, your skin regenerates, it revives itself and layering on all of these super hydrating, moisturizing ingredients only help your skin naturally protect itself. And doing that can help you get rid of acne. It can help you diminish fine lines and wrinkles. Also fill your skin full of beautiful hydration. So when you wake up, you're gonna look younger with plumper skin, brighter skin, I mean, it's winning all around. And boo, here's your special treat. If you made it to the end of today's video, you guys know Romeo and I love and appreciate you so much. All right guys, I love you, wash your hands, stay safe, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye guys.